Hi everyone, welcome back to Cine Stories channel where we discuss all things weddings, wedding photography and videography, and wedding planning. Today we are talking about Filipino wedding traditions. Filipino weddings showcase historic customs mixed with a modern style. The weddings are not only about the bride and groom becoming one, but the two families becoming one as well. Family is huge in Filipino culture and they do not take celebrating lightly. The majority of Filipino weddings are held in the Catholic Church, since Catholicism and Christianity are the most prevalent religions in the Philippines. Priests will give a message that is personalized to the couple, incorporating Bible verses and a prayer for blessings over the couple in their new journey. The couple will also have what they call sponsors, which is an honored position of elders over them, secondary to the parents, who are invited to join in the prayer over the bride and groom. Sponsors or parents of the wedding couple will light the unity candle during the ceremony. For the unity candle ceremony, two outer candles represent the individual lives of the bride and groom before the wedding. Together, the bride and groom will light the third and center candle, blowing out the other candles, signifying their new future as one. Coins known as aras, or unity coins, symbolize prosperity and are presented to the bride and groom after being blessed by the priest. There are exactly 13 coins, and either a coin bearer or coin sponsor will bring them to the altar, similar to the exchanging of the rings. Yugao is the name of a knotted, infinity-shaped wedding cord that is presented by a sponsor and draped over the couple. The infinity symbol represents their bond and infinite commitment to each other. The cord and unity coin traditions will both take place during the ceremony. In the U.S., most Filipino brides will wear a modern white gown, while the groom will either wear a tux or the traditional barong Tagalog. The barong is a thin, finely embroidered tunic worn untucked over a plain shirt at weddings. Long sleeves are most commonly seen on barongs. The bride can also choose to stay traditional and wear the Filipino mestiza gown, a formal dress made of expensive fabric with beautiful embroideries. During the reception, a money dance is a common tradition where male guests will line up to dance with the bride, each pinning dollar bills on her dress in exchange for a dance. Female guests will do the same thing for the groom. And this is a way for the guests to show their hope for prosperity for the couple. Oftentimes, the money dance marks the beginning of the reception. Some will choose to incorporate Filipino folk dances into the ceremony, either by performers or wedding guests who know the dances. This pays tribute to the Filipino heritage. Filipinos are big on traditional food and most will choose a caterer providing familiar options such as lechon, pancit, and adobo. That's all we have for you today. Thank you so much for watching and make sure you stick around for our next video on popular culture wedding traditions.